going on over Z here and welcome back to some more Icarus. Oh, it looks like we're going to start the episode by having to take out a gator. <gasps> oh, I actually... I actually don't know if my uh, my pointy stick will handle this gator or not. Um, so let's go ahead and find out here. Uh, welcome back. Hopefully you're all having a wonderful day. I'm having a fantastic day. I can't complain. And this episode... Oh my gosh, so many things to do. Get out of here. Get out of here with that. Yeah, you're gone. You're done. Okay, I need to go repair this before we do anything else. Uh, last episode, if you missed it, well, look at that. We have a stone house now. It's amazing. It'll hold up better. Um, I read the comments, and I did see that <laughs> there's some upgrades options with the hammer that you can use. Um, I didn't realize that. <laughs> so now I know. Now I know. And now I will uh, forever use that option to upgrade stuff. So let's go and repair that real quick. Uh, let's go ahead and repair our pickaxe as well. And everything else looks good. Okay, so uh, what are we doing this episode? We have got, um, actually, we got like quite a bit to do. We got things that we can unlock. We got things that, hey, 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 no, no, no. Bad Komodo. Bad Komodo. Good God, these guys have a lot of health too. You're not eating my alligator. Oh my gosh, I don't know why you want to eat my alligator. You want to eat my alligator. Um, we are going to go and explore a different cave. Somebody, um, I read some comments and they said that there's actually a cave underwater, like really close to my base. So I want to go check that out. And whilst we go there to do that, I also want to take a, um, a storage bin and set down a storage bin because I think it'll be easier if I just leave that like right by the entrance or whatever. We can just grab the stuff. Um, uh, we can go in once, kill all the worms once, and then, um, just basically come back and grab everything else. So... Uh, are you coming after me? Yeah, you are. Wow, he doesn't like when I took his food. Interesting. Well, there you go. Uh, but yeah, I believe there's, there's, so somebody said there was like a cave, like right here somewhere under the water. So we're gonna check that out. We're gonna get rock and roll on things. I oh mean, gosh, I'm, I'm sorry. This whole intro has like been completely insane. <laughs> We've been getting attacked and stuff. All right, so what's going on? We are going to go into a cave, and I crafted myself another small wood crate. We're going to go get some resources. We're going to start with that. We're going to kill some worms. We're going to grab some resources, and we're going to throw those into the smelter. We're going to throw those in the smelter because we got things to build. I want to get the... Um, let's see. Hold on. Where is it at? I want to get the the station. I want to get the, the short-range radio built. Uh, we probably already have enough for that, and I want to get the um, orbital exchange interface built as well because I think those are going to be the... Um, the, the ways that we do the missions. And I kind of want to see what that's about. I'm not necessarily saying we're starting missions yet, but I want to check that out. Um, and then we have like a whole bunch of other upgrade stuff. So in order to start all that, we need to get some ores. And uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and check that out. So let's go ahead and let's see. I was told, everybody was telling me that there's a, there's a, a cave entrance over here somewhere. But it's like underwater or something, or maybe, maybe not. I have no idea. Oh, may, oh, was it this way? I'm trying to remember, like, it's been so long since I checked the underwater cave stuff. Like, I'm, I'm trying to remember, like, how they actually worked. I thought there was, like, a hole somewhere. Oh. Oh, there is a cave right here. Interesting. Okay. Very interesting. So we'll check this out. And uh, hopefully there's like not any worms like right by the start. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's titanium. Oh, this is like actually in the water. Um, I don't know if I can use my light here or not. Oh, there's a worm. Ow, I got hit by worm goo. Um, okay. <laughs> I don't know about this cave. I don't know about this one. Um, I was hoping that it would like, you know, we'd go up and then it would be, um, it would be, it would be dry. But like, getting the stuff in the water is going to be tricky. Like, I mean, we could probably make it happen. I was just hoping to set my uh, crate down somewhere here in the beginning area. 
But we've got to take this thing out. Nope, don't hit me. Oh, I got you. Okay, that one's dead. I knew there was another one somewhere. All right, you know what? Let's just take this cave out. Let's just let's just run it. Run the cave. Was that it? Oh, oh, that was it. Okay, cool. I'll take that arrow back though. Um. Okay, so let's see. Is there anywhere that I could? I like. I really was hoping to set down. <laughs> I was really hoping to set this down somewhere. Too steep. Like, it's not going to help me if it's over here where I'm going to constantly attract, re -attra can I, put, wait, can I put this in the water? No, it doesn't seem like it gives me the option to put it in the water. Oh, it does. Okay. I guess I can just chill in the water. That's fine with me. That works. Uh, so let's go ahead. Let's mine up all this stuff. Basically, I'm gonna throw it all into here and then we'll make trips back and forth to here Yeah, this will be great. Oh, this is gonna be super nice. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this stuff, too I know everybody's telling me that the um, like I can't really utilize this stuff uh, But I'm hoping that with us doing the orbital missions, maybe we'll be able to unlock the ability to craft with some of that stuff So um, I'm gonna go ahead and gather some more Oh Fantastic I have pneumonia and I didn't make this stuff. Oh, wonderful. All right, so I harvested most of the stuff. I have a couple things in here, but this is full, so not really a whole lot I can do. Um, I want to take the coal back with me. Wow, is that one thing of coal really that heavy? Okay, so I want to take the coal back uh, because we can start making steel. And steel is a huge thing, so... Yeah, I, I can't really mine anymore. And if we get steel stuff, that'd be super nice. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to head back. Um, hopefully I can come back in here and grab this. Uh, we can make a couple trips real fast. Throw it all in the smelter. Actually, we're not going to throw it in the smelter. We're going to unlock some things. So let's go ahead and let's head out of here. And let's head back. Hopefully not run into any issues. Hopefully not run into any crocodilies. There's a Kia swimming right there. Why are those guys swimming? I don't know. Oh god, is that a crocodile right there? Oh, it absolutely is. Oh, this is terrible. Okay, we're just gonna run. Oh, he's fast. Alright, we're gonna have to take him out before we do anything. Okay, we got him. Don't tell me there's another one. Okay, I don't have any room to, to store anything. Let's go drop some stuff off. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's a MOA right there. You know what? I'm just gonna leave it. I don't even care. He can have the crocodile. -y. Okay, so under the tech tree, I believe there's a mortar and pestle that we need to unlock here. Um, ooh, we got tier three stuff. Ooh, that's nice. But we haven't we haven't finished messing with tier two stuff yet. So mortar and pestle, yeah, we're gonna need that because that is gonna allow us to make steel bloom, which is then gonna allow us to make steel. So we've got to get that. We got to get the steel bloom. Uh, and then let's see crushed bone poison paste. We're gonna need all of this too But let's just start with that. Let's see what I need for a uh, what do I need for a mortar and pestle? Is that something oh man, it's super dark in here. Uh, is that something made in a workbench? Oh It is okay silica and stone. I got some silica in here So not that one this one So let's go ahead and craft one of those and then we need to, uh, we're going to start making some steel bloom. So let's put that, uh, maybe we'll put that right here next to the furnace. Okay. 
So now in here, steel bloom, iron ore, and coal ore. Okay, so basically we can go from ore. Okay, that's fine. And then, hold on, let's make sure. Do we have any, we have iron stuff in here. I'd like to go ahead and tech tree tier two. What is the steel stuff, right? We have a steel ax, a steel pickaxe. 130% mine from yielding, 65 mining radius. 60 minus 125. I imagine there's also a higher durability on this, but we're gonna also need epoxy and steel. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's make some steel. Uh, and we'll get that stuff going. So let's go ahead and throw in our iron. I think I had another iron. That's stone. Okay, I had, a, I had another stack of 50 iron in there. Let's go ahead and grab that, throw that in there, and make this. Max that out, so that's going to be 13. Okay, so we'll let that do its thing. What time is it? 19.55. Let's go ahead and let's just sleep for the night. All right, so now that that steel bloom's getting made, uh, we'll go ahead and do that. And then, actually, there was also, whilst we're in here, hold on, there was a backpack. The backpack might be worth getting made. Where was it? It's right here. Crafted at a textiles bench, so we would need this. But then we could get a we could get a backpack, which would allow us plus five kilogram weight capacity. Plus six suit inventory slots, minus ten percent carry weight of ores. That sounds huge. Let's do that. I think that's going to be a big deal. <laughs> so what do I need? I need wood and fiber. Let's take some wood out of here. Do we have any fiber? We have 64 fiber in there. That might, that might do it. All right. There's our textiles bench. Let's go ahead and get that set up over here. And then what do we need for the backpack? We need rope and leather. Guess what? We've got leather and then rope. Oh, rope is made of leather? No, there's a better way to make rope. Hold on a second. Yeah, the fiber. The fiber's the way to make the rope. Oh, we got 46 rope right there. We're good. All right, so let's go ahead and craft that. I wonder where this... Where does this go? Oh, backpack slot. Okay, cool. All right, let's put that bad boy on. Okay, so we're at 120 now. It takes us to 126 and then gave us oh it gives us it gives us another row of slots oh cool very neato um head chest arms feet i probably should go ahead and get some armor going here honestly but i feel like i feel like if we're gonna start armor like i feel like the oh a fishing trap like this wayfinder stuff pla oh platinum weave Oh, that is for the desert area. Cured leather stuff. Hmm. Hunter. Oh, that's... Yeah, we want hunter stuff. Because I want to get these... I want to get some bolt action pew pews going. Because um, that's ultimately like what we're going for. Once we can get that, like everything's going to be... Oh, you know what? If we go... Should we go ahead? Okay. If I unlock the machining bench... I need level 25 for that. However, we also need epoxy and steel screws. So hold on a second. Hold on just a second. Epoxy. That was in the mortar and pestle. So we need that. And then we need steel screws, which is that in here maybe? It's got to be in here somewhere. So I'm not actually even sure where the steel screw is at. <laughs> like here's the workbench. And then these require steel screws. But I, I can't find the steel screws unless it's because I don't have steel made yet. So I'm gonna ha let's let's try this. Let's do a little test here. Let's throw this in here. Let's throw that in there. Uh, let's activate that. That's gonna make. No, that is not gonna make steel. Oh, hold on a second. 
stone furnace, a simple stone furnace for smelting iron and copper. Where do we make steel? Oh, we've got to make the concrete furnace first for iron ingot, rope, epoxy, and concrete mix. So we can't even make steel until we make that. An insulated high temperature furnace for smelting a wide range of materials, including steel. Okay, so we need iron, rope, epoxy, and concrete mix. Concrete mix? I don't even have, I don't think we have concrete mix. It Was that in the, um, was that in the mortar pestle as well? Crushed bone, flour, carbon paste. It's not. That makes me think concrete cement mixer is probably going to give us concrete mix. Concrete is composed of two essential elements, aggregate and cement binder with ratios depending. So this is craft concrete construction elements. So that makes me think that we're going to need this. The cement mixer before we can get the concrete. Okay. So, oh my gosh. So we need, <laughs> we got to work. We need the machining bench first. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, hold on. Before we do anything, let's do this. Let's go. Um, let's go grab our stuff. What's my inventory look like here? Is it, is, are we clean and clear? We're not clean and clear. All right. Let me drop my inventory stuff off here. We've got to figure this out. Okay. We look good there. Is there a crocodile in here? No. Okay. We look good. All right. Let's go grab our stuff. Um, let me just go grab my oars, bring them back. And then we'll focus, I guess on, I guess we got a whole bunch, a whole new tier of stuff that we got to unlock here. My goodness. All right. So we're going to pop in here. I'm going to try to grab my crate. Just like that. And then we're going to pop out. Haha, ha, look at that. Not even an issue with the worms. I like, I guarantee the worms are back too. Every time you leave the cave and come back, they're, they're there. They're waiting. They're always waiting. Oh, I ate a raw piece of meat. Darn it. Completely at forgot. <laughs> Darn it. I can't believe I did that. Um, okay. So I got all my ores back. So now what we need to focus on is we've got to focus on getting, we need to get the machining bench built. And then from there, we got to get some other things. So what do we need for a machining bench? Um, I know I said we we're going to work on this radio stuff, but you know what? Like I said, we're not going to mess with this until I'm fully like prepared anyways. So there's really no reason to, uh, to even worry about it. So um, iron nails, we need 120, we need 40 ingots, we need 10 epoxy. What is epoxy? Okay, so epoxy is sulfur and tree sap. Um, okay, oh, you know what? Oh, I don't, do I have any points? I have no points available. Because the reason I say that is because there's an ability to craft sticks from uh, logs, which is basically giving give you like all the epoxy you could ever want. So we might have to get that going. Um, it was. So sulfur and tree sap tree sap normally is sticks. Okay. So we need to go get some sulfur sulfur is. Uh, I saw some sulfur over there. Actually, there might be some sulfur over here. Okay, let's go. Let's go see if we can find some sulfur. Um, how's my pick looking? My pick isn't too terrible. Let's uh, let's go see if we can find some sulfur. Oh, there's a sulfur and rock right there. All right, so I got a bunch of sulfur. Um, now I need the sticks ability too, but let's go ahead and draw. Holy. Okay. Yeah, we got we got a little bit of sulfur here. So tree sap. And then epoxy. Okay, so let me see what I have for sticks. We got those two sticks there. Let's go ahead and throw those in here, maybe. And then tree sap max. Let's go ahead and do those. And then we're going to go ahead and craft epoxy as well. Okay, now while that's going, uh, we needed, what did we need? 120 nails. So we need 120 nails and 40 ingots. What do we have over here? So we've got 120 nails. Easy enough. 120 nails and then 40 ingots. Uh, we have no ingots in here. Do we have any ingots in here? No, we do not. Okay, so let's go ahead. Um, 
let me activate that. Let me. I'll, I'll try not to forget about it though. <laughs> Epoxy. Let's go ahead and make the max of those. So twelve. Woo! Twelve. <laughs> so we'll go ahead and take that and then throw that into here as well. So there's that. So the only thing we need is our forty ingots, and then that's going to get us the machining bench. And then from the machining bench, we're going to need even more stuff. Do I not have? Oh, I have forty ingots. Hold on a second. Let's turn that off. I have 40 ingots right in here. I was going to say, I was like, how do I not have any? I checked the wrong bench. All right. So there's those. We have enough for the machining bench. Let's craft that. My gosh. Serious technological advancements happening. Like always. It's always about the technological advancements. All right. Let's put this bad boy down. Oh, this is going to be so exciting. Um, okay. So let's just go ahead and set you here. Now, what do we need? Okay, so there's our steel screws. Okay, so one steel ingot does that, but we can't do the steel ingot. <laughs> so we got to get the cement mixer first, and then we have to get the concrete furnace, and then we can get steel. Okay, so uh, wood, stone, rope, and iron nails. Okay, so I think we've got, uh, we've got the iron, wood, rope. We need rope, we need nails, we need some wood. Uh, what else do we need here? So there's the iron. There's the wood, nails, rope. What else do we need? So we need 12 or no, we need, uh, 40 stone and a couple more nails. Do we have 40 stone in here? I got 38 stone. Should be pretty close. Okay. So we just need a couple more nails. Let me go ahead and just take, uh, that. Go in here. Let's go ahead and make a thing of nails. Perfect. Okay, so there's the cement mixer. <laughs> oh, we're getting we're getting places. All right, and then the cement mixer. Uh, I guess we have this whole side of the house, huh? We got, we got, we got, you know, I'm glad about, I made the house as big as I did. All right. The cement mixer to get concrete. What do we need? Tree sap, stone, and silica. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I need tree sap, lots of tree sap, stone, and silica. And we need 20 of those in order to get this. So let's get, um, let's try to get everything else here ready. So iron rope epoxy. Okay. Okay. All right. Can I make rope here? I can make rope. Let's go ahead and make that. I have a little bit of silica. I don't have a lot of silica and we have some epoxy. So iron rope epoxy. Need a little bit more iron. So let's go ahead and activate that bad boy. And then for the epoxy, I think it's actually, I think we're just out of tree sap. I think it's just the tree sap that we need. And you know what really stinks is that we have the ability to make, um, actually we don't have it in our inventory, do we? It's not like a crafting thing we can do. Wood javelin. No. Okay. So we unlocked the talent for this, which is, what is this? Wood breakdown, unlock, unlock the ability to turn wood into sticks, which kind of stinks because then you have to unlock it on top of it. So it's like, really, really? So I need to, I need to hit a level so we can get that. Because we don't have, we have like nothing in the form of sticks. Oh, we've got a hundred sticks right there. Okay, I mean, that's something. All right, so we'll go ahead and get some more tree sap going <laughs> and then more epoxy. Yeah, we've really got to unlock that ability. All right, so for the concrete mixer, we are going to need tree sap, stone and silica. So we need to go out. We need to get a bunch of stone, a bunch of silica. All right, so we get repaired our pickaxe here. Um, I'm a little bit worried about leaving this alone. Like, I don't want to burn through all of this because I do want to go ahead and get some more steel going. But I know we're going to need at least, oh, actually we probably already have enough. If I grab these, let me go ahead and turn that off. Oh yeah, we've got, we've got plenty of iron already. 
we've got the iron we got the rope we need epoxy and concrete mix concrete mix we need uh silica stone and tree sap so i need sticks i need sticks and stones and and a, a weather event that's really what i needed right now all right I'm gonna go ahead. I'm just gonna go to town on mining stone and maybe if I mine enough, I can get my upgrade. <laughs> oh shoot, hold on a second before we do anything. I almost forgot, if I eat that meat, that prime meat stuff, I actually get a 5% experience bonus, which, uh, well, that would be huge. Uh, this stuff right here. That, I believe, gives me 5% experience gained. Oh, we've got like an actual storm coming in too. Like an actual storm. Do I need to repair anything? I think everything's okay. Oh my gosh. Season Longsman. Chopped wood is automatically added to your inventory. That is huge. And then chance to instantly chop a tree. Absolutely. Chance to instantly mine a deposit in one hit. Absolutely. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh my gosh. Reduce damage from falling trees. Chopped wood is automatically added to your inventory. That is amazing. Uh oh, we got a wolf out there. He can't see me through the window though. He shouldn't be able to. So we're in the red storm part right now and it's actually not even affecting anything. Like what? Did, what oh, oh, I forgot this roof wasn't stone. Oh, I need to get that upgraded, but it's not affect anything else. Didn't he didn't even touch it. Wait, I say that and then I think I just heard something pop. Uh, <laughs> didn't even touch. I don't know. It didn't even touch it. It seems good. Oh, my fireplace went out. Okay. Uh, there's a crocodile right there. He may have seen me. Just trying to get into here to grab this. Wow, he did see me. What a jerk. How can he see me through here? Like, you know what I mean? Like, come on, really? Really? Fine, you stupid. Oh man, it is nasty out here. Come on, stupid. Oh, you're only a level five? What a jerk. I need to upgrade this too. Actually reminds me, I need to upgrade a lot of these uh, poles still. We don't need to talk about that though. All right, back to mining the stone in the trees. Man, if I can mine this whole thing in one hit, that would be amazing. Like this is a huge stone deposit. This would give me so much stone. Oh. Come on, let's get that 1% chance. Let's go. <laughs> I would be fully encumbered, but it's a, it's completely okay. Oh, also, my uh, my weight is now 152 because there was a talent for the solo where you increased your uh, inventory weight capacity by 25%. <laughs> it's, it's like huge. Oh, there's a pumpkin under this rock. That's a rock pumpkin. Oh, <gasps> yes. Yes, we got it. We got the whole stone. <laughs> yes. How much should we get from that? I'm curious. That was a big rock. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> I can't believe we can even move right now. I'm, I'm surprised we can move. This is, oh my gosh, this is so good. Okay, let's go through. <laughs> let's go throw this into our concrete mixer. Oh, I was hoping so hard. I was. Oh, that was that was perfect. So much stone. Like just to give you an idea, the the I the trip that I was making before last trip was my full inventory trip. I had two and a half or three stacks of stone. This time I had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen stacks of stone oh that was so good that was so good yes we've got stone a lot okay so i need silica and tree sap fantastic so 
So I think we're set on... I think we're set on the um, on the stone for a little bit. We need some silica. And I need a bunch of sticks so I can get some tree sap. Because we don't have the ability to, um, to, to craft our sticks yet. Which oh, we really got to get. You know, does chopping trees give us sticks? Oh, it does. Oh my gosh. And now that we're collecting stuff automatically. Oh my gosh. Yes, that's amazing. I mean, I guess I get sticks doing this too. This is a... Wow. These upgrades. I'm telling you. I harvested the whole tree in one hit. <laughs> this is. I love these. These upgrades are the best. Like in the fact that we can that we're just picking up the stuff too. Oh my gosh, that alone is great. But the fact that you can harvest it in one hit too, still. Mm. All right, so for the sticks, let's go ahead and tree sap, max that bad boy out. 70 something, okay. Organic resin, I don't need that right now. All right, so that's all good. Let's go ahead and drop our uh, wood into here. Wow, so much wood, that's fantastic too. But now we need silica. So let's go ahead and grab some silica. Hopefully before it gets dark, that would be nice. I'm gonna pop over here. Oh, there's a crocodile right there. Going to avoid that guy. I think it's silica right here too. Yes. Okay, good. We got a couple nodes right here. Okay, I think we're good on the silica for a little bit. Mine 200 silica. Look at that. We got a little thing too. Oh, there's another silica thing right here though. And a sulfur thing. You know what? We're gonna, we'll come back for it later. Uh, we can't get everything all at once here. All right, so silica. Let's go ahead and add silica, 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 and silica. All right, so let's grab our, uh, what do we have? Tree sap in here. Let's add the tree sap to here. And how much can we make? Max of 54. Uh, that's going to use all of our silica. That is fine. Let's go ahead and get that going. Now, um, I probably, I need more epoxy though. So I need more tree sap, <laughs> more sticks. Oh, we need the ability to make the sticks so bad. So then we can get our tree sap and then we can get more epoxy going. Oh my gosh, this is eight minutes and 15 seconds. Holy good gosh, that's a lot. And then is that everything we need for the concrete furnace? Um, besides the epoxy, which actually we might have some tree sap left from that, but we'll probably go out and just grab some more, uh, go grab some more trees since we're not doing anything anyways. All right, there's another 76 sap coming along. <laughs> That's good. And then we've got, oh, look at that. We've actually got our 22, uh, we got 22 concrete mix, which is good. So actually all we need now is our epoxy. So we'll go ahead and craft up the epoxy and then we are good. Then we have a concrete furnace, which then we can use um, our steel bloom and make iron and then we can make, or the steel, then we can make steel screws. And then we can make uh, after steel screws. Okay, hold on. Let's look at our tech tree here. Now, I do know that I have to be level 25 in order to get the um, the pew pews, but we have everything we need. So basically what I need to go out and do is do a bunch of leveling. Um, and that's actually not too terrible. So the fastest way that I think it to level is run around and cut down a whole bunch of trees because as you, if you the actual act of cutting the tree down is 300 and like five XP. So basically you just go around, and cut them all down <laughs> and then harvest them all up. Um, I mean, cause then you have a bunch of wood anyways that you're going to need anyway. So, um, I'll probably end up just doing that so we can hit uh, level 25. We can get our pew pews cause I definitely want, uh, all of these, but the, the main one is the, the bolt action rifle. That is what I want the most. Um, and then we're going to also have to start making gunpowder and, and, and all that fun stuff, which requires a lot of charcoal. And that's why I have charcoal going basically all the time because we're going to need it. 
All right, so let's grab, uh, let's see what we have in here. We've got our epoxy, grab this concrete furnace. Let's make that. And actually, I think this can make everything now too, if I'm not mistaken, uh, this can make, let's see, let's get this one. Put it right next to this one. I think this can do everything that this one can plus. So let's see. Yeah, it can do iron. It can do copper. It can do all kinds of things. So let's go ahead and take all. Let's go into here and then let's put in these. All of that. Okay, so now what I need to do is I need to decide how much steel I want and how much iron I want. So do we have any, we do have coal left in here. Let's go ahead and get that. Let's max that out. What is it? Uh, it's only gonna take half of that. So we'll get go ahead and get 25 steel bloom going here. So let's go ahead and let's activate. Oh, we need some kind of fuel source. Let's just throw in uh, wood. We'll activate that bad boy. That'll start making some steel for us. Uh, but I don't know that I want to necessarily. Oh, silica can be made from glass. We can also do aluminum, platinum and all that fun stuff. Oh yeah, that's gonna be, see, that's gonna be so nice. So also I don't have these unlocked either. So the steel ax, the steel pickaxe, steel knife i'd like to get those unlocked as well but we don't have that look at that steel ingots oh we're already doing the things it feels good it feels good to already be doing the things like it feels good to have that already going so we'll throw those into there how much more steel can we do we could do another 25 I'm gonna go ahead and do another 25. We're gonna need so much steel anyways. Um, and then if like, this is gonna need six, that's gonna need six. The spear's probably gonna need, yeah, 24 steel ingots. That is huge. That is a huge number. Uh, we also need to get the hammer. We could get the steel hammer. Oh, we could get so many steel upgrades later. Uh, then we need 40 steel for this guy. Ooh. And then not to mention every round, we're going to need iron and gunpowder. What is gunpowder? Let's see. So gunpowder is sulfur and charcoal. Okay. So not bad. So it sounds like basically what I need to do here is I need to go on a gathering expedition. I need to go out, gather sulfur. We need to gather silica, sulfur, iron, basically everything. Uh, so that way we can get some pew pews going. And then we could start, oh my gosh, I can't even imagine having a pew pew and just like taking out a croc, taking out a crocodile from like right here. It's like, where'd you go? Boom, baby. He gone. Oh, I can't wait. I cannot wait. But that is going to end this episode. Thank you so much for coming out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, like, subscribe, all the fun things. Um, we made steel production. We got to steal. We're making steel, people. It's, it's a good time. I'm excited. But yeah, thanks again for coming out. Have a wonderful day. And I'll see you next time.